Our Kilowatt Cowboy profile is a cowgirl who happens to be a multiple Hall of Famer, J.J. Hampton. I was born and raised in Steenville, Texas on a ranch about three miles north of town. Grew up in a rodeo family and my dad competed in rodeo and Johnny Wayne Hampton. My dad was always going rodeo and so my mom, Barbara Hampton, helped us practice and she knew nothing about roping, doesn't ride, but we practiced nod, kick, swing and throw. And uh, to be honest, till I probably got out of my last year in college, did I get consistent. Now I could win first. If I caught, I won first, and now I can win first more consistently because I catch more. But my mom taught me nod, kick, swing, and throw, and it stuck. My special event is the breakaway roping, but I, I won more world titles in the tie downs. I won tie down, head and world titles, all around in breakaway, but my specialty is breakaway roping. And I was at a professional women's event in uh, Cottonwood, Texas, and actually on my first cap I was 1.7, and I'm asking myself, you know, how am I going to beat, you know, I'm 1.7. And the uh, next calf I was 1.4. I uh, had a wonderful, great, awesome horse named Fancy. And uh, I was 3-1 on two calves, and the people who won second weren't even that fast on, on their one calf. So I, it was a tremendous day for me. But that's just my secret trademark. I, I'm a reacher. I like to throw rope at the calves, and that's not, uh, I just have a unique style. And it, and it works for me. I, I go for it every time. I know I've lost a lot of things probably because of it, but I've won more than I lost. So I just keep doing it. Um, I thrive on competition. I enjoy competition, um, inducted into the Texas Rodeo Cowboy Hall of Fame, the Texas Cowboy Hall of Fame, and I have a star on the Stephenville Walk of Fame. So I have a blessed, been blessed with a good career, but I've also been honored by receiving all these awards. If you have a dream, you just need to stick with it and do it. Um, I, I, I've been a kind of a chunky kid almost my entire whole life, and I, I, I tell kids when I go somewhere, even if you have any kind of something wrong with you, a handicap, something, don't ever let that set you back because it's all in your head. Yeah, maybe it might hinder you a little bit, but if, you, if you've got the will, there's a way. And I just, you got to believe in yourself no matter what you do.